I tried to print ASA on OpenFrame in their 3v2 and this was the result. At a hot end temperature 240 degrees Celsius. Look at that. The surface is it's disgusting. So I went a little bit down with the temperature at 230 and this was the result a little bit better but here you can see the below effect it was on the first one too here you can see and uh, then I went a little bit lower on 220 this looked so much better and the surface is almost perfect a little bit ghosting but it worked I used no adhesion spray or glue no uh, for these small objects you don't have to by the higher and uh, taller objects it's better to use uh, adhesion spray or glue and uh, use the brim shelter in cure it's uh, good for protecting the model from uh, wind and uh, temperature change so yes it's possible to print on open frame printer but you have to be cautioned because when you don't have the right parameter set uh, it can end with spaghetti and clocked hot end too so yes this is the result it's it's pretty nice it's it looks like uh, almost like PLA you can post post process with some isopropyl alcohol to make a smoother surface when you compare these two cubes cubes you can see the difference Two hundred and forty degrees Celsius and two hundred and twenty. Don't worry, try other other temperatures and you will get the result. You uh, you can go down here experimental. Enable draft shield. This is it. And when you go to preview, you can see all around the model is made wall with one perimeter. that keeps safe the model from temperature change uh, I, I thought it will not help but when you have a first layer with a small area like this it uh, could stop warping and uh, detach the model from print bed and it it uh, did not took so time and uh, material so it's worth it i think 